Hey guys, it's Ro. Welcome to another Nerdy Nummies. I got so many requests from you guys to make something Harry Potter themed. I live in California. The Wizarding World of Harry Potter is opening at Universal Studios and I'm so excited. It was the perfect time to make a Harry Potter recipe. So today we're going to be making butter beer milkshakes. Let's get started. The things you will need will be one bottle of cream soda, some butterscotch syrup, whipped cream, three-fourths teaspoon of salt, some butterscotch chips, vanilla bean ice cream, and back here I've got some milkshake glasses because I wanted it to look like a traditional milkshake with some cute little straws, a blender, and an ice cream scoop. Now let's put it all together. Boop. Time to make these wizard milkshakes. This recipe is good for two milkshakes for two people. I put both the milkshake glasses into the freezer so that they would be nice and cold when we serve our milkshakes. We are gonna be mixing everything up in a blender. This is a very easy mode recipe, easy and delicious. We need a half a cup of butterscotch. Before I pour it, I'm gonna spray it so that the butterscotch will slide right out. Oop, feels like potions class. I'm in there. Oh, into the blender. Now we're gonna open up our cream soda. High pour, high pour. Next, we're gonna add our vanilla bean ice cream. You're gonna need three and a half cups. And then this little scoop is a half scoop, so I need seven scoops. Last but not least, we're gonna add our salt. It may sound a little weird, but it's gonna make it taste magical. And now we're gonna mix it up until it's fully combined and smooth. Hit and liquefy. There we go. Our milkshake's ready. I took the glasses out of the freezer. They've chilled, they're nice and cold. Just gonna give them a little bit of decoration. A little butterscotch on my spoon. Drizzle it around the inside. I'm gonna do a couple of spoonfuls in each glass. Now we're gonna pour in our milkshakes. Ooh! I like to garnish my milkshakes with whipped cream. This is totally optional, but I love this. All right, just a little bit on top. Here we go. I just like to make it look pretty. Now I'm gonna sprinkle some butterscotch chips on top. This is totally optional, but I just think it's so yummy. Don't forget your straws. Ta-da! Here are the butterbeer milkshakes that we made today. A big thank you to you guys for suggesting something Harry Potter themed. I love butterbeer everything. We've made butterbeer cupcakes before in the past, and now we have made a butterbeer themed drink. Yum, 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 yum. I'll be taking lots of pictures and posting these on Tumblr, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And if you guys make these drinks or any other Harry Potter drinks, please take a picture and send it to me. I love seeing your baking creations. It just makes my day. And if you have any other ideas for any other nerdy nummies, please let me know. Leave me a comment down below and I will do my best to make it happen. All right, thanks again, you guys. Bye-bye. You can make the recipe or you can just be like, Accio Butterbill Milkshake. My milkshake brings all the muggles to the yard and they're like, they're not allowed. <laughs>